Hello, and today we're looking at replacing the DX7 NiCad battery with a new Rhino 2620mAh 3 cell LiPo transmitter pack. And by getting the transmitter pack, you get the JR Spectrum port pre wired into the battery, um, and then you can just wire up a charge port. In this case, you use the Dean's, and you'll have your balance port. So you can throw it on any LiPo charger and get yourself up and flying. Um, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to flip the transmitter around. We're going to pop the back battery cover off. And we're going to remove the NICAD battery. Um, to un un unplug it, simply pull down on the wire. Um, trying to get as close to the connector as possible so you don't trip it out. Inside there, there's also a piece of foam. We're going to remove the foam. And then we're going to take the new Rhino Pack and make sure that you have the keys for the plug to plug it in correctly so that way you don't reverse your polarity and fry your transmitter. So we plug that in. We're going to take the Rhino Pack and just place it in there. There's not a whole lot of room for it to move around. It's pretty stable in there without the foam so we, we're not going to be using that on this part. And then all we're going to do is there's a little bit of room here on the left hand side to tie all your cables in so we're just going to kind of tuck our cables in as best we can here because uh, we don't want to pinch any of those when we put the back cover back on and so we did that let's flip this around here and so now if you want you can actually just turn it on and you can see that you have full battery power it sees 12.6 volts this doesn't hurt your transmitter it'll be just fine um, but what we want to do is we want to try to protect our lipo a little bit more so we're going to actually reprogram the alarm limit so that it'll go off at 10 volts um, instead of the default 9. So to do this you have to press the access button which is pressing the scroll button and the select button together like you would for a um, selecting a model and before you turn it on you want to make sure that your Aerolon dual rate switch is in the zero position, the up position away from you and so we're going to turn that on and it comes onto the model select like we're used to. We're going to scroll up until we reach model reset um, and for those following along, I'll give you a second just to make sure you're there. Alright, and so what we're going to do now is we need to press the adjust, which is on the right hand side, increase button. So we press that once, and then we're going to flip the dual rate switch to the one position. Once we do that, we press the decrease button, the down. Then we're going to go back and flip the arrow on dual rate switch up again, and press the increase button. Switch goes down decrease, switch goes up, increase, switch goes down, decrease, switch goes up, increase, switch goes down, decrease, you do it five times, and the LCD will go to a screen test. From there, we're going to scroll up twice, which gets us to the battery alarm menu, and from there, we're going to press the increase button until the alarm gets to 10 volts. The DX7 doesn't let you go above 10, so that's the max, so that's kind of best case scenario at this point. Um, and once that's done, we're going to go back over to the scroll side and we're going to scroll up until it says all settings okay. And to accept it as yes, press the clear button. It'll go back to your original model and you're ready to fly. So, very simple. Um, you can order the transmitter packs at a lot of different websites. This one was from Hobby City. Um, and all you have to do now is make sure that when you do charge it, not to use this port. Um, if you use this port, you will kill your LiPo because it's a nickel metal hydride charger and it's a LiPo battery inside and it's connected up just like the old battery was. So make sure you know throw some tape over that or um, somehow actually you know physically block the, the, the plug from being used otherwise. So that's it. Have fun flying. You